Um, today I'm having lunch with the fabulous Florence oh, Tan, okay. who has amazingly managed to talk me into eating tripe and lung satay. So we have tripe, lung, beef and chicken down here and some nasi lemak and I think little anchovies, which mm. anchovies are my nemesis. So we're going to see. I think I'm actually key, more keen to eat tripe than I am to eat anchovies. So we're going to try the tripe and we're going to try the lung and see if I survive. Alright. All right. Good job, Florence. Chili sauce? Okay, it's really sweet. It's got a nice texture. Actually, that's really delicious. That's really good. Mm. Can you eat that every day? Well, I think I'd get sick of it every day, but... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's actually really good. Like, I would never um, just eat that and go, oh, it tastes like tripe, because obviously I don't know what tripe tastes Okay. Like. <laughs> Put that down. It's now time for the beef lungs. Oh, okay. Beef lungs. Right. Beef lungs. <laughs> um, we'll see if this makes me, like, sing better or maybe move. Who knows? Okay. It looks really dense, um, kind of like when my grandfather does a barbecue and forgets to take things off the grill. But we'll see. Oh, I just ate. Mm. Yeah, good. I'm trying really hard not to think about what this is. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> also very sweet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad. It's yeah, actually not yeah. bad. Yeah, good. good. I've had oh, um, a lot of the, the Scottish pies with the kidneys and um, lung and heart and things in them, and they're so terrible. I would never ever eat them again as long as I live. But this is actually really good. So I'm tempted now to see can I give my children tripe and lung on a stick? and see if they notice the difference because they seem to think that everything I cook is chicken anyway. So I think I might have to try this one when I get home. <laughs> I'll have to get your secret recipe, Florence, to know how to cook a like this. <laughs>